Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today it is time for part 3 in my draw a lipstick and if you don't know what that is, I've done two parts before if it is part 3 it should have been two parts before this I am drawing one of my red lipsticks that I've put in this one and then I do my I look based on the lipstick I get so like the other way around so I'm going to draw a lipstick and I have taken out I think all of the red lipsticks I've used almost so I'm going to pick something so let's just pick I got this one this is one from Colourpop. This is Liquid Courage. It looks like this. And I have decided to do a makeup. If I can, I want to take shadows from the same brand as the lipstick. And that I'm going to do because I have a lot of eyeshadow palettes from Colourpop. So I'm going to swatch the lipstick, see what I want to do, and then we just get started with this makeup. So I've decided and I, I'm i going to do something green. And uh, I picked out two palettes. I picked out the Zodiac palette and Good Sports. And if you have ever seen this, and if you ever have heard me talk about Good Sports, I guess you know that I'm going to do something with Ebb. But... I'm going to start with the Zodiac and I'm going to take um, Libra and Capricorn for this. So it's going to be like a half cut crease with Ebb and I think this is going to be amazing. It's a real simple but a really cool look I hope. So I'm going to start with Libra in my crease and I'm sorry if you can hear some Christmas music my neighbor is behind this wall or they are the neighbors maybe upstairs they are uh, listening to christmas carols yeah and i really i really <laughs> i really felt like i wanted to take two palette from Colourpop that both of these are discontinued and I don't use them on my channel that much but I wanted to do that because I think this the thing I really like about this series is that I can choose things that are a little bit older and I am trying to be all about using the things I have in my collection so yeah I hope you like that as well and I guess that some of you might have these two palettes or something similar. This Zodiac palette, I don't know what's up with this. Some of the shades are really 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 good. Uh, some of the shades are shit, most of them are shit. And one thing I don't like about this Zodiac palette is the colors that are good are like the colors that are like this. And I actually did a series last year with this palette, the Zodiac series. I can leave my playlist up here. So I used a shade each month to create a look around. And I have done some of my absolute favorite looks in that. And I have done some of my not at all favorite looks. Now I'm going in with <laughs> Capricorn. And this is a black one with a gold glitter. But... This is one of these kinds of glitter that blends away. Good shimmer specs. I have heard it has that because it's easier to blend it out. I guess that's that might be true. But this is the only black I have from Colourpop. I was like, okay, I know what I want to do. And I really want Ebb to stand out and I think it can be a really cool look to have like a black and then have 
ebb on the most of my lid. So I was looking through my palettes and I was like, I don't have a black from Colourpop. But I had this. Okay, and do you see like the crazy amount of fallouts I get from this? So for the star of the show, I'm going into Ebb and it's now I don't know because I need a mirror in the Zodiac palette. So Ebb, this one, I'm always so happy when I can use this. Okay, how should I make this the easiest for me, maybe like this, so okay, and I don't cut my crease or anything, I'm just going to slap this on and do you see this? I don't know why Colourpop haven't done this as a single shadow because I am sorry for you that didn't buy good sport good sports good sport I can never remember if it's good sport or good sports. For all of you that didn't buy it and missed out of Ebb. I... And like imagine a dark brick red to this. This is going to look so, so good. And I am taking this up in my crease and over the black. And I'm going to go in to the black again. I'm going to go back in with Capricorn just a little bit. So I dip my brush, tap it off, and just making it a little smoother. I hands down I love this look and I am done with the lids like this so I'm going to close the palettes so I am happy with the lids like this I do love them so I'm going to take away the fallouts fix my base my brows I might do the under eyes as well I don't know we will see and then I come back with how it looks with the lips and everything. Maybe I should take on the lipstick with you. I think I do that. So I'm just going to fix this face. So the only thing that is left is the lipstick. I just did the same that I did on my lid on my lower lash. So I thought you, you might not want to see that. And for my waterline I took crossed from Colourpop. So just put... I'm just going to put on this lipstick that is Liquid Courage. I don't know which formula this is. I don't even know if it still is available or not. But this is Liquid Courage. And I'm just going to slap it on. Stop talking and just do it. Like bullet lipsticks is not my favorite. I think it's so hard to get like a good line on my lips, but this worked. This worked good. So this is my third part with draw lipstick. I I love this look. I love ebb. I love the dark, dark black. I love the lip to it. I. I just love this look, so I just used three shades, and I actually thinking about showing you some dupes for Ebb, because I swatched a little bit while I was doing my makeup, so just a little extra for this video, I have so much stuff. And the swatches that I, or the dupes that I found, first of all, actually in this recently, the C but recently deceased by melt i know this is limited edition as well but if you're thinking about picking this up i don't know if this will push it for you but it might be and then also from the oceanic by 
is Boutier, this Anemon. I'm going to show you the swatches. And none of these are an exact dupe. And the last one is from Kale Kaleidos Sci-Fi Green. It's this one. I don't know the name of it, but... So, this one is Ebb. This is from Melt. This is from Oceanic. And this is from Kaleidos. Ebb is like a little bit more grungy, I would say. And... This one is just a little bit lighter, the one from Melt. This Anemon is a little bit greener and the one from Sci-Fi Green is a little bit more gold. But here you have some, at least a little bit of dupes that I had in my collection. I just wanted to show you that because I rave about this ebb shade and I always feel a bit bad when I do it because it's no longer available. So. Here you have some dupes. And okay, <laughs> I am just going to end this video now. I really hope you like this look and you like this video and that you are liking my month that I'm doing with with the with 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 the oath with I really hope you like this. So yeah. I hope I will see you again tomorrow. And if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos. And I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!